Good morning everybody, I hope you're all doing amazing, I hope everyone's having a great day so far. Today I'm going to be showing you all a day in the life of me. I know you might not find anything interesting, but I thought I might as well show you all what I do on a day to day basis. Maybe it will motivate some of you, maybe it won't. And also, I have a haircut so I think that will be quite a cool thing to vlog because I am looking very, very homeless at the moment. Um, so gonna get the day started the time is currently focus 5 30 a.m. now I've been starting my days off this early every day regardless of whether it's a work day or not because I just feel like it gives me that extra few hours on everyone else just makes me feel good about myself feel like I've actually achieved something in the mornings um, I never used to be a morning person but now I prefer the mornings over the evenings because I feel like I can get more done so with all that said, let's get started with cardio. And we have got some cardio going on. Um, 30 minutes of cardio every morning. That's what the coach says. Uh, 45 minutes on the days I have rest. Um, every day, it does get easier. I find it goes quicker. Obviously, it's still the same amount of time. But I find I'm just enjoying it more and more every day. Um, because I'm seeing progress as I'm going, it just feels amazing. So, I've got 28 minutes left of cardio to do. I'm gonna get it all finished. That is cardio finished with, now let's go and start the day off right with some breakfast. We are back, I have some breakfast. It's uh, 50 grams of oats, 30 grams of blueberries. Yeah, I know, what the fuck is that? I've got my BCAAs. And I also have my protein shake, which is Synthes 6. Absolutely amazing. I would recommend it to anyone. Now, you'll probably be sitting there wondering, why are you sitting outside eating your breakfast at 6.15 a.m.? It's a beautiful day. Why wouldn't I? Birds chirping, blue skies. Got my little set up. You're probably wondering what I'm using as a table as well. Two giant speakers, because I'm broke. Now I'm absolutely starving, I'm gonna eat this breakfast, get some energy in me, and I'll speak to you guys in a minute. One quick little tip for you all. If anyone struggles to eat their gloopy porridge, get your protein shake. Pour about, I'd say one third of your protein shake in there, all right? Give it a little mix about. Looks absolutely disgusting, but I promise you, this is the way to eat your oats. So, if you swish that about, all right, not yet. Wait till it's got a nice consistency, almost like a milkshake consistency. Now here's what you do with that information. Yes, I drink my porridge. I don't think it's a big deal. It's the easiest way for me to get it down. I normally really struggle to eat porridge. And obviously this is in my diet plan, so I can't go without. If I was just sitting there eating it, I'd be there for about 20 minutes, just munching on it. That is breakfast finished with, I've got a full stomach. I'm happy. Right, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna read this for about half an hour because it's still quite early, it's only seven o'clock. Um, probably got two hours until I can eat my next chicken and rice meal. And then I have a haircut. So, I'm looking forward to that. I'm gonna get reading. The next time you guys will see me is at my chicken and rice meal. There it is. I am gonna pause this video here and let you all know I am aware of that strand in the camera shot. I apologise, there's nothing I can do about it now. I look like an amateur, I might as well delete my YouTube. Meal two of the day, chicken, rice and broccoli. I know it doesn't look appetising, but it is actually quite nice. I've sort of perfected the art of using um, spices or herbs or seasonings, whatever you want to call them. So it's not just bland chicken anymore. It's actually quite nice. Um, so I have got a haircut in an hour. I need to eat this as quick as possible and get the bus there. So let's get this down. Meal two done and out of the way. Now it's time for me to leave and go and get my hair cut. Do you know what? I'll tell you all one thing now. The weather is fucking beautiful. Just, where's the sun? Where's the sun? Look at that. I can't believe it. This is beautiful. I love it. So I'm on my way to get my hair cut. Go catch the bus because your boy don't drive yet. Um, 
bit awkward. It's just, just walking past people. It's well awkward. Um, first time vlogging out in public. Let's see how this goes. Got away 11 minutes for the bus to come. Now what I normally do in this time is put on some motivational speeches on YouTube and listen to them. Just makes you feel good. Puts a smile on my face whilst I'm out in public so I don't look like a moody fucker. And we are here. Without a word, with just a smile. Two of us were I to I that night. You and I. I try to walk between the raindrops, ride the waves of every storm. I thought I love was always worth fighting for. I'm standing on an empty rooftop, finding out to begin. gentleman lounge if anyone needs a haircut go there because i promise you it'll be the best haircut you've ever had in your entire life the reception's amazing customer service is amazing uh they honestly three of the best barbers in there i've ever seen in my life i would say they're up there with the best in the uk um sell all their own branding products honestly you couldn't you couldn't ask for a better service neither if you need a haircut remy gentleman lounge i'll put the link in the description below and um you can also use an app called Booksy, they've just got on to quick and simple, get it done very easily. Alright, so now that I've got my hair cut and let's get the line. Looks decent. Uh, I'm going to get the bus back home. I am going to eat my third meal. I'll see you then. Yes, the transition changed. I'm not wearing a t-shirt no more. A bit more burnt skin. Um, but we are back. We are on to meal three. Chicken, rice, broccoli, mayonnaise. However, I did realize today how much calories, how many calories mayo had in it. So I've had to cut down a little bit because fuck me. But can we also appreciate just how beautiful today is? I honestly feel like I'm abroad. The sun feels that good on my skin. Oh, fucking beautiful, love it. So I'm gonna eat this. I'm going to go and meet Archie, uh, try and get to the gym for one o'clock. And today I'm going to be absolutely obliterating my shoulders and triceps. Um, I'll explain the workout plan to you all. Um, I'm also going to be trying to catch some cool footage of me in the gym. It's going to be the first time doing that, so let's see how that goes. I'll see you guys in the gym. We are at the gym, ready to smash some shoulders. You're training shoulders, isn't you? Yeah, smashing, yeah, smashing some shoulders. I'm going to get straight in there and get straight into working out. See you guys in a minute. Absolutely gorgeous scenes in the gym. It is absolutely empty. Have a look at that. Gym to myself.
mate, the gym finished with absolutely killer session. Shoulders and triceps are killing me. Um, I cannot believe how hot it is. It's like 30, what is it, 36 degrees? 36 degrees. God has blessed us. The gyms have opened, the weather's perfect. This could be a good couple of months. Currently on the way home to eat meal four, which is tuna, rice, and vegetables. See you guys when we're there. Right, Archie just informed me that I have forgotten to record me eating my, my last whole meal. Listen, it's hot. Leave me alone. Um, that's the tuna and rice meal finished. Uh, last meal is going to be yogurt and rice cakes. That's my last meal. I'll probably leave it a few hours, otherwise I'll be absolutely starving. Um, it's only half four. I've got two deliveries. I'm going to show you what they are now. I can't even actually remember. Oh, I ordered boxes. That's what it is. Three pairs of boxes, boy. Your boy's got some new boxes. These are the ones I'm going to be wearing in my posing videos so I can look a bit more presentable for you all. Not wear some baggy, loose, disgusting boxes. I do think about you guys. And the other thing. Little book to keep me motivated. Um, I've started reading every morning, in the evenings, probably read for about an hour a day, I find it just helps me relax, makes me feel like I've done something. Um, this book is called Own Life, it says how to show up with confidence and take control of the future, because big things are coming. So, that is that, it is currently 4.30, I'll probably see you guys at around 7 o'clock when I eat my last meal, um, and then I will debrief the day for you all. Um, Quick update. I've just discovered how to make a BCAA slush puppy. Quite nice. And welcome back. The time is now just gone 10 past 8. And I have my two rice cakes and my protein yogurt. Um, the reason it's so late and I'm eating this meal at this time is because I've been doing something down in the garage which I think is quite exciting. Now I'm gonna eat this and I'm gonna tell you all what it is and show you a quick glimpse of what I've been up to. Just finished my last meal. Oh, currently walking down to the garage where I'm gonna show you all what I've been working on. Nothing massive, but I'm quite proud of it. Yes, you guessed it. I have been down here transforming my garage into somewhat of a gym. Now, it hasn't got everything you need, no, but it has what you need to get a decent exercise. Any exercise, be it legs, chest, back, arms, shoulders, traps, anything. You can train whatever you want down here. It's even got a running machine. It's got speakers. It's got everything you need. So, uh, you're obviously all thinking, why have you done this? The gyms have just opened. Yeah, I know they have. But, I know some people aren't going to feel comfortable enough going straight back into the gyms. I know maybe they're going to want to look a bit better, get their strength back up before they go back into a real gym and start paying some some money. You know, someone might not want to go to the gym and pay loads of money um, to use it. And the reason I've done this is because I want to let people know that who feel like that, they can come here whenever they want. They're free to use all this stuff. I'm not using it as much as I was before, so it's just gonna sit here. Um, so obviously, anyone that wants to come down and use this, at any point, just give me a shout. Um, obviously, I'll be here. I won't let you just come and use it because obviously you might feel more comfortable if I'm there. Um, I can even help you with training tips, form, all that kind of stuff. I just thought it'd be a good idea, you know? I thought I could. I'll help, I'll help people out, I'll help people out. I'm not going to put all this equipment to waste. So if anyone doesn't feel comfortable going into the gym or 
doesn't want to pay extortionate prices for a gym membership, feel free to message me and we can sort something out. Obviously, too many people won't be able to fit in here because it's not massive. Um, but yeah, it'll be a good atmosphere and I think it'll be a good learning experience for, for all of us really. Um, but I'm going to close the video out here because I am extremely tired. I've got to edit some of this video. Um, I hope you all enjoyed it. I will be making more like this hopefully soon. Now, I'll see you guys in the next video.